In this lesson I will show the technique with which I created the vision project. Let's create a layer and apply the Stardust plugin to it. I use the emitter box type, but you can use any other type. I have set a constant time for better particle control. This effect does not require a large number of particles. Let's create the main grid. Use the transform node to create a grid in one plane. Now let's duplicate the replica node, this is to create a more interesting grid. It is required to set a randomness for the best effect. I have limited the maximum number of corners. Let's set the color for the particles. The parent particle will give the color of the entire line. For lines, you need to increase the density, but for the basic setting, use a lower value. You will have many ways to control the grid. For a better look you need to create additional panels. Duplicate the main grid.
now you need to collapse the entire grid on one of the axes. Change the seed to create a different grid. It is necessary to restore some settings to the default value. Now let's create a three-dimensional hologram panel. Let's arrange them in space.
Thanks for watching.